Get off. Come on. Oh, hi. Okay. Yeah, give, give me just a minute. Okay. Yeah, if you give me just, okay. I'm on the phone. Okay. Sorry. Sorry about that. Oh, no, it's okay. Yeah, how can I help you? I'm Valerie Vaughn with ADP. Are you Mr. Corleone? Uh, I'm Gio. Yes. Gio, it's great yes. to meet you. I met Gianni last week at the coffee shop. Okay. I did. Oh, there's Gianni right there. Gianni? Yeah, hang on just okay. a second. Hello? I am. She's standing right in front of me. Uh, not really. I mean, you know, I wish you'd have told me, you know, you wanted me to be a part of this meeting because, I mean, I'm working on some reports for the bank that I got a meeting this afternoon. Oh, my God. I know. I'm so sorry. I know. Uh, well, I'm, I'm on my way. You should talk to her. Uh, I'm not sure. I'll, uh, I'll, I'll take care of you. You on your way, though? Just hurry, just, just hurry up. Uh, okay, and, and you're with? I'm with ADP. You're with ADP. Okay. okay. And you guys do what? We do payroll processing solutions. Okay. okay. All right. Uh, I mean, it's really not a good time. I mean, okay. love my sister to death, but mm -hmm. I mean, I've got some reports that I'm trying to prepare for the bank. And okay. uh, it, is it possible just to reschedule? Could we have a few minutes until she gets here maybe, and I can just go over with you what I was planning to tell her and then maybe catch her up? Uh, sure. Okay. Sure, I guess. Go ahead. Sorry. Time? Sorry that she did that oh, to you. It is okay. <clears throat> okay. Well, before we get started, I really appreciate you giving me this time. I'd like to offer you my business card for okay. future reference. Do you happen to have one for me as well? Uh, I don't. Okay. Not on me right now. That's okay. Things are kind of crazy. <laughs> I understand. Well, normally when I meet with a customer, it takes about 20 minutes, and I talk to Gianni. Uh, do you have about 20 minutes today? Uh... Uh, if that, okay. that you know, we can work with that. Okay, I'll definitely be respectful of your time. Okay. Well, Mr. Corleone, I've done some research on Giovanni's desserts, and I've just been really impressed with all the Italian desserts that you offer. And I must say, I'm a huge fan of Italian desserts. Actually, last summer, I visited Venice, had some Italian gelato, and truly loved it. Mm. So I'm really looking forward to trying all that you have to offer at Giovanni's desserts. And with your five locations, you've been such a success. What do you think has been... Uh, your key to success? Well, uh, to be honest with you, we're, we're kind of fighting for our lives right now. Okay. So, you know, we're in some high-end strip centers and yes. it's been difficult. Okay. So, I mean, I'm, I'm, uh, I'm just trying to keep things afloat right now. So, okay. uh, not, you know, don't need that shared with anybody, but, uh, okay. you know, I mean, we've had some success and mm -hmm. we've got to get some things turned around though pretty quickly. Okay. Yeah. Well, I would love to help you with that. At ADP, we believe our key to success has been our ability to provide successful small business owners with an innovative payroll processing solution that enables them to utilize payroll processing as a value driver for their business. Now, do you think that payroll processing should be a value driver for your business? Uh, I think payroll processing should just be one of those things you do, but you don't have to think about. I understand I'll be that. pretty simplistic. Yeah, definitely. Yeah. That, I hear that very often. Um, at ADP, we thought about it and we think that Payroll processing should be the value driver for your business. In fact, many of my customers know me as Miss Value Driver. And after implementing our system, they consistently report increased cash flows, reduced operating expenses, and greater peace of mind. And that's really what I'd like to explore with you today. I'd like to see if we can unlock payroll processing value for you. Is that something you'd like to learn more about? Uh, I'm happy to take a look at it. Okay. You know, again, I mean, I'm not in the what in the business of changing mm -hmm. payrolls, but again, okay. Gia, Gianna got you into this, and I'll, I'll be glad to just take a look at it because I am the one who runs it. So, okay. Yeah. I appreciate your time. Okay. Then. Sure. Well, when I was thinking about the meeting today, I thought we could at least accomplish four things. We might not have time for the fourth, however, um, but I would like to set up an agenda. So first. I've done some research on Gio Giovanni's desserts, and I'd like to confirm that research with you. I'd also like to expand on that research, so I'll need to ask you a few questions. Is that okay? Sure. And then I'd like to examine your cur current <clears throat> payroll processing and see what is and isn't working. Then I'd like to show you a brief hands-on demo of our product, ADP Run Mobile. And then if we have time today, I'd like to go over a brief value discussion with you. Okay. Is there anything you'd like to add to that agenda? Uh, no. Okay. It sounds, sounds like you got it set up. <laughs> okay, then. So when it comes to evaluating a payroll processing upgrade, who would be involved in that decision? Uh, that, that's going to follow me. Just you? Yeah. 
So assuming we find a good fit today. Gianna handles marketing okay. and kind of social media, the branding of the company, but I do all the operations and, and run payroll. Okay. So if we find a good fit, you could make a decision today. Uh, I probably won't make a decision today, okay. but I'm the decision maker. Okay. okay. And then if you could think of a perfect payroll processing system, if you were evaluating that, what two key performance indicators would you use to evaluate your satisfaction with that system? Simplicity mm -hmm. and cost effective. Okay. So um, to summarize, would that be basically ease of use and affordability? Correct. Okay. And then I've done some research, like I said, on Giovanni's desserts. I saw that you have the five locations, four in Atlanta, one in Savannah. Mm -hmm. Is that still correct? That is correct. And I saw that you had about 50 employees. About mm -hmm. is that? We're below 50. Below 50. Yeah. So 40? Yeah. 49. 49. Okay, yeah. then. Well, well, we'll stay below 49. Otherwise, we're going to hit some mandates. Okay. You know, yeah. Yes. Have to get a full-time HR person, et cetera, several things that are, okay. are too costly. So. Okay. Yeah. And with the, the five locations, are you thinking of adding any other ones in the next year? Uh, no, because not right now. That take us over 50. And like I oh, said yeah. at the beginning, mm -hmm. we're, we're struggling. Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, I'm okay. not sure we're going to have the doors open in six months. So we're, okay. we're trying to turn things around. Okay. Well, I'd love to help you turn things around right now. And with your current payroll processing system, let's... Uh, say tomorrow's payroll day. Mm -hmm. Now you said you're very involved. Could you walk me through how it's done, what system you're using, how frequently? I use a company called MCheck. Okay. And um, you know our employees log in via the computer. They mm -hmm. punch in there. Okay. And uh, um, you know there's times when I got uh, my store managers or I've got to fix key punches. You okay. know they're, they're miss punches and things okay. of that nature. And um, then when it comes time to run payroll. Uh, so when we fix all the missed punches, I import it mm -hmm. and then, you know, go through the processing there. So, okay. yeah. Uh, how frequently do you run the payroll? Bi-weekly. Bi-weekly. Mm -hmm. And how long does it take you to process the payroll every time you do it? Um, you know, just between the, the key punches, uh, I mean, I'd probably, you know, tell you 40, 45 minutes, okay. uh, you know, I mean, well, Probably between all the punches and everything, bi-weekly, you could probably, you know, do two or three hours. Okay. You know? yeah. Okay. So about four to six hours a month then? Correct. Okay. And then uh, with the AmCheck that you're currently using, about how much does that cost you? Um, we're paying about $8,000 a year in okay. total. Okay. So, wow. Yeah. You know, some months, obviously, we have three payrolls in that particular month, but annually, mm -hmm. we're spending about $8,000. Okay. And with this current system that you're using, if you could rate that system on a scale of zero to ten, what would be your satisfaction rating? Um, you know, I mean, I'd probably put it at a six or a seven. Okay. You know, I mean, it's uh, it's okay. I mean, there's some issues. It, it only operates on. Uh, oh. Hey, Johnny. Hey, Speaking Valerie. of the devil. I know. Good, Valerie. Good. 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 So good to see you again. Great oh to my see gosh. You again, hey. Too. Glad How's you can make it. Is it going good? It's going great, yeah. We were Perfect. just starting out. I was talking about how I really think that payroll processing should be a value driver for your business. Oh, yes. I'm known as Miss Value Driver, so that's what I'm all about. <laughs> good. Um, yeah, so we just started out. We've talked about the current locations that you have. Okay. I've confirmed that. So are you all too far in to go back to the beginning? Uh, no, I mean, I can give you a, a summary if you'd like. A summary? Yeah. <clears throat> um, I, I really don't have time okay. to go back to the beginning. Okay. So, I mean, I love my sister, but um, we'll... She needs to keep plugging. Okay, okay, I'm, okay. I'm on right. a time okay, all right, that's fine, that's fine. Okay, okay. I can definitely keep doing that. I'll keep, catch you up afterwards. Oh, thank you, you so like. much. You're okay. Welcome. Okay, so we're right now we're saying that the system, the payroll system we're using right now is rated about a six or a seven. Okay. So there's definitely room for improvement. Would you agree? Right. Uh, yeah. I mean, uh -huh. it's, it's not a ten. <laughs> it's not a ten yeah, for sure. Right. Um, so can you think of a time over the past twelve to twenty-four months where your payroll system has underperformed? <laughs> Um, yeah, I think maybe as she was walking in, um, you know, the site is not aesthetically pleasing from okay. a window standpoint. Mm -hmm. um, the, uh, you know, I can only use it on Internet Explorer, oh, which wow. I'm not a big Internet Explorer yeah. fan. I mean, I'd rather use, you know, Google Chrome yeah. or uh, Firefox or something like that in mm -hmm. Mozilla. So, um, okay. you know, that that's kind of a, I had always had to just kind of go out into the Internet Explorer and then, okay. you know, to be able to download payroll into QuickBooks and stuff. Okay. So, yeah. Wow. Um, and then with all this time you're spending, you said about four to six hours a month, what would you be doing with that time otherwise if you had it to spend? Uh, I mean, I'd be focusing on running the business, mm -hmm. you know, and trying to find other areas to cut costs yeah. and or 
stay on her tail to try to grow, <laughs> grow the business because we, yeah. we need sales and yeah. you know okay. um, yeah trying to trying to just make sure we keep the doors open and uh, mm-hmm. um, but I spend a lot more time doing yeah. those things I agree completely now can you think of how that would have a financial impact on revenues if you could spend that time in the business um, you know I mean just directly I mean it's kind of like anything else you know just uh, prior to me you know getting out of what I was doing before you know one of my buddies is a controller and he goes mm-hmm. in and has to find, you know, these large manufacturing plants a million dollars of reduced cost every year, mm-hmm. you know, through trimming it up. So I know we can trim things up. We can maybe buy products cheaper and you yeah. know, spend more time with vendors negotiating and things of that nature. So, uh, you know, I know on the operations and business side, you know, hopefully I can go in and find some reduced expenses while working with Gianni to try to find some new revenue growth streams or create some new opportunities. Definitely. And yeah. I can see that for sure. Now, with the, the punching that you said that goes on for the, the employees mm-hmm. with the time cards, has there been any compliance issues or any issues with that at all? No, I mean, because we fix the punches. Fix and, you know, okay. I mean, our store managers, sometimes I give them the administrative privilege, uh, privileges to be able to do that. Sometimes it falls on me, depending on uh, what's going on during the day. But, um, but from a compliance standpoint, no. I mean, we, we teach our folks to live properly, use weight belts if it's over a certain weight, bend their knees when they're picking up stuff. Okay. And hopefully we keep the floors clean and we don't have any slip and falls. So, yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, and then I know you said that you're taking on all, all the payroll. Has there been any additional stress with that? Has there been any impact on morale or anything, emotional side effects? <laughs> uh, well, I mean, hopefully uh, the employees don't see any stress that we might be mm-hmm. feeling at the top level mm-hmm. so I mean you know I mean as I told you when you walk through the door I mean things are difficult I'm meeting yeah. with the bank and yeah. you know so it's a pretty stressful time and mm-hmm. you know we've got to figure out how to how to reduce costs and, and grow revenue yeah you know at the same time and I think we can we can survive and, and then begin to thrive I can definitely agree with that so I'd like to give you a brief summary of what I think I've learned so far just so I have a clear understanding of what you want and why so right now you have a payroll system that you're rating at about a six or a seven and what you really want is a system that meets your needs in terms of ease of use and affordability. And also, you, um, if you had the time that you spent on payroll, you would be spending that running the business, trying to cut costs, and overall just taking a little bit more stress off of your shoulders. Is that a fair summary? Um, yeah, I mean, that sounds pretty accurate. Okay. Yeah. If I could show you how ADP could meet your needs in terms of ease of use and affordability, would you be willing to consider a payroll processing upgrade? Well, I mean, right now, quite honestly, I mean, I'll consider it, but okay. it's, you know, we're we're kind of knee deep. It's April, you yeah. know, from April to November, it's our, our time to sell. So, mm-hmm. you know, we're really focusing on that. But, I mean, you know, you're here. Okay. Uh, if you can show us some stuff, I'll be glad to take it into consideration. Okay, great. Well, I'd like to go ahead and show you our product, ADP Run Mobile. Now, do you mind if I scoot a bit closer to you so you can see the product since you're running it? That's fine. Okay. And now, I know you said you didn't have any prior experience with ADP. Have you done anything with ADP in the past? Uh, I had not. Well, I mean, I I didn't know who you guys were. Okay, (laughs) Okay, so ADP is the largest provider of business processing and cloud-based solutions in the world. Over 400,000 small to mid-sized businesses utilize our services, and one in six U.S. workers are paid by ADP. So what I'm going to show show you today is our product, ADP Run Mobile. I'm using it on the iPad. It is very mobile. You can use it on your phone. You can use it on your laptop. You, do you can use it on your phone? Yes, you can use it on your phone. Don't have to use Internet Explorer either, oh. so there's a benefit for you right there. Now, I'd like to go ahead and get you involved. If you don't mind, go ahead and hitting resume weekly. She spends a lot of time on the phone. <laughs> <laughs> Hit the which one? Right here. Okay. Swipe it. Oops. Oh. <laughs> no, it's okay. If you just touch it. Oh, just tap it. Yeah. <laughs> See, I don't have that with Amcheck. So. <laughs> so this is the first page this allows you to see your check date and your start date and uh, just make sure you're accurate from the beginning now do you currently utilize direct deposit uh, some of the employees okay so we do yeah. have that feature it comes with ADP run mobile you can turn it on and off is that turn it on for everybody or just whoever so has if you have it selected for direct that, deposit just yeah. like pre- okay yes all right so now if you'll hit resume down here okay and then this page right here shows you the list <clears throat> of all your employees so if you don't mind swiping through that it just oh there yeah we go. yeah so you can see all your employees in one easy to read hmm. easy to reach location now if you'll click on Matthew Baxter this allows you to see if they're using an hourly rate or they're paid by a salary amount it's all right here easily to be input um, and then if you'll swipe right here as well it, you can switch through the employees so do you see how easy hmm. that is to use 
<clears throat> Who's clean office? That could be if you have a contractor. Oh, so these aren't necessarily oh, you pay your employees. Contractors too? Yeah, you can pay contractors too. Okay. If you'll hit preview and then calculate. And then this screen right here shows you the total cash required. So that allows you to see exactly how much you're paying the employees to make sure that's correct each time. Do you see how that's a very easy to use screen? I mean, I, I, mean, I, like, the, I like the touch screen. Yeah, sure. it's very nice. And if you'll hit approve and approve payroll. And then it has one last safeguard to let you know what you're paying. And then congratulations, you just performed your first ADP run mobile payroll. How did that feel? Hmm. It's so much easier than what we're doing now. <laughs> yeah, I, it's very it, easy. It, you don't do payroll. Well, right? it's so much easier than what he's doing now. Okay. Yeah. I understand. I see yeah. him do it. Sisters. What did you think? Uh, <laughs> I have yeah. a sister. <laughs> Um, I mean, it's I mean, it's nice. It, I mean, I like the touch screen and yeah. being able to maybe do it mobile. Okay. Uh, doesn't tie me down to the office. Um, the uh, and I can remote in from my home if mm -hmm. I want to mm -hmm. and, and run it at eleven yeah. o'clock at night. If that's when I get to it. Yeah, okay. definitely. Okay, interesting. Okay. So I mentioned earlier that if we had time, I'd go over a brief value discussion. So I think we have that time today, and I'll go ahead and go into that. I know you said you're looking for affordability mm -hmm. as well. So I'll show you our fee schedule at ADP. So with forty nine workers. You're going to be in this bracket right here. So the fee is $68.95 per pay period. So yours is bi-weekly. And <clears throat> are you using your centralized? Is it all at one location? Yes. Okay. But no, um, I mean, they, they all, I, I think the reporting comes in centrally. Yeah, okay. even though they're different okay. locations. So it'll be about $1,800. Now, how does that price look to you? Now, I know that I've got like a separate fee for the web access, mm -hmm. you know, for the time manager, you know. If you and, wanted to utilize. Yeah, that. to be able to import it. I okay. mean, I, I assume there's a separate fee mm -hmm. as, as well. Yes. And then you've got just the pay, you know, the base payroll fee based yeah. on the employees. So if you yeah. wanted to use a time and labor management system, is that right. what you're saying? Right, yes. right. Because that's, that's what's going to make this easy. Yeah, Because I don't want to sure. have to input it. Yes, you know, I want to be able to yeah. pull it over. It is very integrated. Our system, Easy Labor Manager, can do that. And okay. if you would like to implement that, that's our TLM option. Okay. So if... um. Most people, you can either do a web-based timesheet. We would be web-based. Web-based. Yeah, I don't want badges and stuff. Okay, so it'd just be fifty dollars per month. Okay. For that. Hmm. Okay. So how do those prices look to you? Uh, looks like it might save us some money from what we're currently paying. I know, especially yeah. with that eight thousand dollars. I mean, that's it's just quite some savings right there. And I was going to input it in for you real quick so you can see firsthand how much you would be saving. So our fee would be eighteen hundred a year if you decide to do that and then if you want to do the TLM option that's going to be it's a quick question it seemed yes. like uh, when you got 41 to 50 employees mm -hmm. is there a you got your base fee but is there like a three or four dollars per employee that goes on top of that no, no? Exactly. okay yeah hmm. yeah so that's gonna be six thousand dollars at least estimated annual net value gain how does that look um, looks pretty good compared to compared to what compared we're paying. Compared to what you're paying, sure. for sure. Yeah. So I know you indicated that you would be the decision maker today, mm -hmm. and given this great estimated net value gain, this great way to save you money and also take some stress off of your shoulders and really just drive value for Giovanni's desserts, shouldn't we go ahead and get this started today? Um, you know, I mean, kind of given our situation, you know, you're looking at five hundred dollars a month in savings. Uh, you know, right now, I just don't see where we could transition it. I mean, okay. it's, it's April. It's mm -hmm. our busy season. Okay. Um, it's just going to be, you know, I'm, right now it's just going to be too difficult. Okay. You know, I'm just focused on some other things. But, I mean, it's it's very impressive. I might call you back next week or okay. a month from now and say, hey, you know, I need every penny I can get. You okay. know, but Well, uh, you do have my card, and I will actually be here when you implement the system. So, I really think time is money, especially now at Giovanni's Desserts. So if we can go ahead and get this started next week when you run payroll, I'd be glad to help you with that whole implementation process. How does that sound? Uh, well, first of all, I wasn't expecting you today. Okay. Um, you know, uh, I like what you have to offer, but uh, I'm not sure I would do it that quick. But okay. I, I would just tell you, don't don't contact Gianni, and okay. uh, I love her. But, <laughs> okay. Uh, you can email me. Okay. okay? Actually, and, uh, I'd like to have a tentative meeting set up. So how about we well, do Tuesday e or Thursday? Email me next week, and then we'll set something up. Okay. But, uh, you know, I'll... Uh, you know, I need to kind of process this, get through my bank meeting this afternoon, see where I stand, okay. and you know, see if they're going to kind of help me get through some okay. some changes. And then I think if that happens, then we okay. can look to implement some. I of really this. have an opening to come in the same time next week on Friday. Would you be available then? Uh, when you email me early next week, okay, I'll lock I'll lock it in with you then if I'm available. 
Okay. So I, I don't know my schedule too far in advance. Okay. Yeah. Would you like to get coffee again? Oh, that would be perfect. Okay. I would love to. I'd like to give you another summary. So if yes. we can do that on Monday, would that be okay with you? Oh, yes. That'd be great. Thank okay, you. Okay. So I'll see you on Monday for coffee, and I'll send you an email to set up on Thursday. How does perfect. that sound? That perfect.